Okay, YouTube, it's your boy Joe from Attention to Detail Home Mobile Wash Service. So, I did a little upgrade on my uh, trailer here. You're going to see, I'm going to share it with my, my people, some of my fellow detailers, whoever thinking about getting an enclosed trailer. So, a while back, I did an inquiry about uh, having a van versus a trailer. They both got its perks. But with the trailer and van, I had to weigh them in, pros and cons. So I'm gonna stick with the trailer. All right, so here's what I did to the trailer. You're gonna see it. So I got the inside, I got the 275 for a water gallon, water tank right here. Uh, I got my little bungee cords. And on the back side, I got my ladder, my vacuum hose, my truck brush, RV brush, whatever they call it. Got a little area for the gas. So I won't slide. So I got my refill hose right there. And also I have my little supplies, towels and stuff like that. Got my bag with all my drills in there, plus some little hardware if I have to change everything else. I have my power cord, my bottles, which I will modify that later on. You'll see why, but and more to come as I go to the outside round back so this is what I did I went to rackham.com e-trailer I'm sorry e-trailer and got the rackham self self uh, shelf easy to do so what I did was I built the shelf the platform I got rid of my 250, my 450 foot hose reel. Got a hundred feet hose reel. I got a magnetic tray so I can put my little tire gauge and air, air so I can for the customer. They undeflate it, put some air in their tire. If they, if they don't have the uh, the uh, what you call it, oxygen air. Uh, now my compressor. I mean my pressure washer. Everything just goes in the back. I have it in the back. So this is what I'm a little proud of. This this here would keep the air supply going for me. It's it's low on noise and obviously the air compressor a little bit louder than that. So also what I did is I got one of these little this little tool container organizer tray from uh how you call it Harbor Freight for like eight dollars. And all I do is just keep everything on that when I'm out on the field. Let's go ahead and I put the things where they need to go. Got some air quick connect hose, some nozzles, pressure washer, uh, some of the miscellaneous stuff. I mean, you know, some uh, Teflon tape, um, you know, little O-rings, some miscellaneous things, some screws and bolts, just in case if I could reconnect everything else that should be good and that's what i'm working with so hey man this is my setup tell me if you like it i'm proud to share comments let me know attention to detail joe out